All right, we're gonna do some examples of combining like terms from your notes. There is another video called What is Combining Like Terms? So if this concept confuses you, if you get really stuck on it, I would go and watch that video first because that one breaks down the concept a little more. These are just some math examples. So the first one, if I have negative three A plus nine A. So here's a trick. If you watch that other video, you see I use stars and moons. Sometimes when we see these variables, these letters, it's hard for us to think of what they actually mean in math. So sometimes what I like to do is assign a name to them that makes a little more sense. So I have negative three apples, or I owe three apples, and then I add nine apples. That might help you. So A, these are what's similar. The A is similar and the A is similar. They're on the same team. So I'm gonna circle both of these. I'm gonna make my t-chart to figure out exactly how many apples there are, right? So I have plus, minus, I have positive nine, negative three. So my positive team wins by six points. So I have six A. And that's how you simplify that expression. Let's look at another one. Let's say I have just the number three by itself plus 4x plus 2x. All right, so if you want to assign a term to that, x is kind of a hard one. I often just use x-men. I have four x-men on one team, and they're going to join forces with these two other x-men. So what is similar here? What is alike? Well, the x's are alike, so I'm going to circle them. This one's not alike because it doesn't have that X. It's just a whole number. So this is on its own thing. So I'm gonna box this one. Remember, I like to do different things for the different teams there are so I know what I'm combining and what I'm not combining. All right, so let's combine these. I have positive four and a positive two. I know four plus two is six, but I could also do my T-chart over here and have four and two, so they have all six of those points. So I have six X, and I'm not done there. I need to add on my three, because this three is by itself. It had nothing I needed to combine it with. So I have three plus six X, and that is my final answer for that one. Let's do one more. Let's do two X plus four minus 7x plus 6. Okay, so let's think about, first of all, what, kind, what are the teams I have, what is alike and not alike? Well, I see these x's, and I have two of them, so there's x's. I see a number by itself, a whole number by itself, and another whole number by itself. So first, I'm going to annotate this. I'm going to box my x teams. I have 2x, and I have negative 7x. Do not forget to get those signs in front of there. It tells you if it's negative or positive. And then I'm gonna circle these. I have a positive four and a positive six. So first I'm gonna combine my the ones I boxed, my x team. So I have two and negative seven. So I'll do my first t-chart. And I have a positive two and a negative seven. So the negative team wins by five. So I have negative five x. And then I'm gonna do a different t-chart. We have to do a separate one for these whole numbers. And I have positive four and positive six. So I have four and six. So they get all 10 of those points. Positive 10. So my simplified expression is negative five X plus 